Hey there nerds, Jim here with my review of Archer and Armstrong number zero. Usually I'm not a big fan of zero number comics. I think they're just kind of ways for companies to get more money out of us. But I really enjoyed this one from Valiant. It's a break from the storyline that they've been doing and you have Archer trying to catch up on pop culture. Pretty cool because we all know he's been holed away with his parents for a very long time as they've brainwashed and inundated him with their way of thinking. So Armstrong comes in and entertains him. His first story that he wanted to read was the story of Gilgamesh, which I know of, but I don't know anything about it. Armstrong breaks in and says, I know this story, you don't need to read it. So he begins to tell the tale, and it's not just one guy, Gilgamesh, it's the story of three brothers. How does he know this? Because he was there. And the brothers are Ivar, Aram, who is Armstrong, and Galad, who we know is his brother. And it's really cool because he tells the tale of the three brothers setting off to find this ancient thing, which turns out to be the boon, the whole thing that started this mess in the first place. They find the boon, and what's really cool is it ties right back in to Armstrong, Archer and Armstrong number one, and when the boon set off and exploded, basically the very first page of the comic. I really enjoyed it. I don't know how Fred Van Lent knows this history, how he knows all sorts of history. I'm very impressed with his writing. I really enjoyed this book. I'm going to go ahead and give it four out of five nerd skulls.